screen PC, of course. And guys, like, look at this. Literally, boys, this is so smooth. Like, this is crazy, bro. I'm recording fully at like 1080p, 60 FPS, with like even a hand cam and everything, basically. Bro, what is going on? And today's video, guys, I'm going to show you my zero input delay Fortnite setup. And this is, by the way, not clickbait or anything. This right now, what you see is pretty much like the lowest amount of latency you can get right now in Fortnite. I'm not joking, guys. I got the new Wooting 60%, which is the fastest keyboard, 0.1 millimeters actuation point. I'm not allowed to share too many informations about it until the 27th. So therefore, you just have to take a quick look here. I'm going to show it real quick here and now we gotta continue like it's not even there yeah okay I'm, I'm not allowed to share anything so therefore i can only say um the stuff which i already know about the full size version 0.1 millimeter actuation point and there's like a low latency mode for under one millisecond response time so therefore it's really really good i'm not joking guys this is like the lowest you can go right now then next up we have my gaming pc with the rtx 3070 ti um the asus i don't know how it's called something but a really beefy one 32 gigs of RAM, Ryzen 7, 5800X. In the Deepcool case, by the way, huge shout out to Deepcool. And now finally guys, I also got my stream PC actually to run and if we zoom in, we can see the Elgato 4K60 Pro. So therefore I can fully capture everything, you know, in, uh, I don't know, I could even stream at like 120 FPS with that. Of course, some drinks guys, if you're a gamer slash YouTuber, you're always gonna have some drinks there. You know, we got here, what do we have? Some Coca-Cola Zero in there, you know, small bottles. And we also have some fused tea, which I already drank almost the one six pack. So therefore that's the only bottle left and some water, of course, guys. <laughs> and yeah, if we got to take a look here back at my setup for the rest, we got the Shure SM7B because we want really like top tier, high quality audio. This all leads into the cloud lifter that we got my Nintendo switch. And then we also got my Fortnite fish. <laughs> what is Tico doing here? By the way, huge shout out to Tico for actually following me on Twitter, bro. Like. Yo, what are you doing? Yeah, I, I just invited him here over to my house, guys. <laughs> then we have my old super light, which I actually modded a little bit. Camera, focus, please. Okay, yeah. We got like glass mouse gates, super, super fast. <laughs> and a fake Jeep Pro. Then we have my Go XLR, in which actually all the audio leads, guys. So I'm going to roughly explain it. The audio from my Shure SM7B and my headphones goes into this Go XLR into my PC and it also duplicates the audio and sends it over to the streaming PC. So therefore I can have everything, all the audio in game, like talking with people, having Discord and everything on there. But I still have like audio on the gaming and the streaming PC so I can like flawlessly stream. And I gotta say guys, it's literally the best. Like I can stream with zero input delay. By the way, don't mind the cables guys. I just set this up literally like one or two days ago. So therefore I have to like clean it up. Don't even think about it, it's not there. But literally what I wanna say is, it's so low latency literally while streaming. It was crazy. I tried it out real quick at 4 a.m. And I gotta say it was wow. Like literally so nice. Then for the rest guys, guys with a scroll wheel so therefore it's also pretty cool not gonna lie there we have the xbox series s controller there we have my charger and everything and yeah for the rest this is it boys this is pretty much like the lowest amount of latency you can get right now in fortnite not joking and yeah the monitor is xl 2546 but as you guys have already maybe noticed a lot of fortnite pros still prefer this one over even a 360 390 hertz one because it has DIYC, which makes 240 hertz even more smooth. And also if your FPS actually drop below 240 FPS, it's still gonna stay smooth. Like you can Google DIYC, this is like the technology Zoe is using. That's why this monitor is still getting used in eSports. Like, I don't know, CSGO, Valorant. Like people still prefer this one, even over 360, 390 hertz, because it's smoother. So therefore guys, if you're wondering, this is the lowest amount of input delay setup you can basically get on YouTube. And if we're gonna, nah, I can't even show it, but on the back side, it says literally that this is the fifth one produced. I've got like the fifth booting to 60%, which is crazy to think about, like the fifth in the world.
Oh my god, let's go. Okay, boys, we get the first kill here. With the booting 60% and actually also zero ping, bro. This is so unfair, literally. I'm not even gonna lie. Oh, what's good? What's good over there, homie? Okay, nice. Let me come for you. Come on, bro. We ain't got time for this. <laughs> okay. I mean, fair enough, boys. Bro, this is crazy, literally. We're playing on a 0.1 millimeter actuation point keyboard with one millisecond delay and zero ping. Let's, let's go, boys. Okay, nice. And when it comes down to input delay, guys, I can only say that this is super, super smooth. Like, I'm right now here recording with my second streaming PC, of course. And, guys, like, look at this. I can continue like this here infinitely, literally. Litchy boys, this is so smooth. Like this is crazy, bro. I'm recording fully at like 1080p, 60 FPS, with like even a hand cam and everything basically. Bro, what is going on? This is so smooth. <laughs> what? Oh my god. And for the stream PC guys, oh wait. Yeah, this right here here is like a stick on where I can put like my camera on the next time. This is actually what I wanted to do for this video, but I guess no. And uh, yeah, I got mousepad for XL real quick. You can see it, it's really nice. There we have now the Zoe S1 and I gotta say, especially as a person with like really big hands, this mouse is like one of the first ones in a long time which actually fits me, which is crazy. Like really, I love this mouse. I tried it out in Fortnite, it's so nice. And yeah, for the string PC peripherals, we have the Razer Huntsman uh, v V2 TKL with purple optical clicky switches. And the Microsoft IntelliMouse. This mouse is older than me, guys, by the way. This is like from 1999. Because I tried it out, DJN actually won a DreamHack on it because it's also like one of these mice for larger hands. But I gotta say, like, it's 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 not good. I'm gonna keep it real. And with that said, guys, this is it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel. This would help me out so, so much. And if you still have any more questions, feel free to ask me them down in the comment section below. I try to answer as many as possible. And with that said, have a great day, have a great night whenever you're watching this. And until next time, stay awesome. I'm out. Peace. Bye.